Okay, hello everyone. Welcome to your 15 minute stretch break. I am Kate. Caitlin, thank you so much for joining today. Um, today you just need a mat or some carpet. Um, we are going to start at the edge of our mat, arms up, reaching nice and tall, and then you're going to keep your legs straight as you can, walk out into a plank position. So engage that core, and then come back up. Taking it nice and slow, stretching out those hamstrings. We'll just do two more. Taking it really slow, getting a nice stretch. Perfect. One more here. Awesome. Walk all the way back up, standing up, reaching tall from here. Person. From here, we're going to take our arms, pulling them back and down, opening up our shoulders and our chest, and then we're reaching back up. So exhale as you pull down, inhale as you reach back up. You should feel a little pull through the right part of your chest. If you don't, bring your elbows back just a little bit more. Two more reps here. Again, perfect. Relax here. Shake it out. Rolling those shoulders back, up by your ears, down and around. Good, then rolling forward. Now we'll go into some arm circles, so nice big ones. Take your time around. One side feels a little tighter than the other, that's okay. Just breathe into it and see if you can let yourself relax around your shoulder your chest. Perfect. And rolling backwards. Awesome. Okay. Stepping your feet just a little bit wider. We're going to take our left arm, slide it down along our leg, reaching that right arm over your body, pulling back, back slightly above your head. Good, then we'll switch over to the other side, reaching back over your head again. Side to side a couple more times here. Wonderful. Since your feet are nice and wide, we're going to sit into a, a lateral lunge, getting a nice inner thigh stretch. Make sure you're staying back from that heel, chest stays up. And then we're going over to the other side. Again, sitting back from that heel, straight leg, toes, toes, toes pointed towards the front. Good. Side to side, just a few reps here. One more time for today. Perfect. We'll bring our feet just a little closer together. And next, we are going to bend over at our hips, push those hips back. Bring it to a nice deadlift position. Back is flat. And then we're going to bend at our knees, sit into a really nice low squat. You can bring your feet in or out, whatever feels best to you. Keep your chest up, back is flat. So a nice opening of your hips. Good, 
I will put our hands on the ground and then straighten those legs. This time you can have a bent spine. Relax your head, let it drop down. Try to feel a nice stretch those hamstrings. Good, we'll sit back into that squat again. Pressing those elbows on the inside of your knees, chest is up. Working side to side. You get nice and deep into your squat. Good, let's do one more. So hands on the ground, pressing those legs straight. Good, and then into that squat. Awesome. Hands down. You're going to stand up slowly. So one vertebrae at a time. Once you get to where your hands can go right above your knees, press there and then lift that chest up. Do a to the side. You're going to have a nice flat back. Push those shoulders back. And slowly walk. Awesome. Okay. Next, we're going to come down to all fours. So working your way down. We are going to bring one leg out to the side. And then we're going to curl the opposite toes underneath. Sit back in that heel. So nice inner thigh stretch here. And then come forward, just rocking back and forth a few times. You might be able to get a little deeper here than you did on that lateral lunge. Perfect. Okay, we'll switch over to the other side. Curl those toes under, other legs straight out, sitting back in that heel, coming forward. One more wrap. Bringing that knee in, we're going to take our right hand, um, bring it underneath, palm up, and right shoulder down to the ground. We'll let it drop all the way down. And then you're going to take your right hand, put it behind your head, rotate up to the right. A really nice spinal rotation here. Come underneath, grab the needle, and then coming up and rotate. Four reps on each side. Wonderful. When you're ready, switch them over to your other side. So left arm underneath, palm up, left shoulder down to the ground, then hand on the side of your head, rotate. Four reps to get on this side. Perfect. Okay, we're going to go into some cat and cow next. So staying at all fours, you can curl your toes under just to work on engaging that core a little bit. We'll round your spine, drop the chin, go into the cat. Drop our belly, chin up in the air, going into cow. Good. Exhaling into cat. Inhaling into cow. Back and forth. Getting some movement through your back here. Exaggerated. One more rep each. Wonderful. We'll go knees wide, feet together, standing back into a child's pose position. We'll walk those fingertips out as far as you can. Feel a 
really nice stretch through the shoulders, through your spine, and then let your hips feel heavy. You feel a little pull through the hips as well. Good. From here, we're going to bring one leg up. So we're going to bring our left leg up. You can let your knee drop out to the side. So just a few seconds. Opening up at the hip. So we'll bring our left knee back forward again, taking that left arm and I'll rotate it up towards the ceiling. Good. Look up at those fingertips. And back down and then step back and we'll switch sides. So right leg up, we'll let that knee drop out. If your hips are really tight, you will feel this. <laughs> Good. Bring that knee back forward and then look at your right hand up forward. Perfect. Hand back down, step back. Let's do one more time each side. So step from that left foot back up, dropping out, opening up that hip. Good. Knee forward and adding in that rotation. Hand back down, step back, other side, dropping your knee out. Knee forward and adding rotation. Good. Hand on the ground, step back. We're going to roll onto our back for the last couple exercises here. Stretches. <laughs> okay, so we'll bring our right leg up in 90 degrees and internally rotate that leg. Then we'll bring our left leg up. Coming into a supine figure four stretch. You're going to grab behind your left leg, pulling in. You should feel a nice stretch through your glute, through your hip, and maybe even into your low back. Wonderful, we'll switch sides here. So left leg into the rotate, right leg come up and pulling in. Good, let's do one more time each side, pulling in. Good, switching final time right here. Perfect, pulling both knees in. You get a little pinch here in your hips, and then rolling on up. Thank you so much for joining today. Check out all of our other classes on our YouTube channel. And I hope to see you in person or virtually again soon. Have a great day.